more convenient motoring is the dream of every car owner in Britain. The commuter, Ford's prototype electric runabout, could well be one of the answers to that dream. At present, there are only two of them in the world, this one being demonstrated and one in America. In a few years, there's the strong prospect of seeing millions of them on the roads. It's just as likely you'll own one like this or one of several others which are being developed. Electric cars are easy to drive, only two pedals, and even more important, they're quiet and inexpensive to run. Refueling means plugging into a handy electric socket to recharge batteries. There's certainly a future for this sort of transport. Agreeing with that is Alastair Carter, design chief of Carter Engineering, the man responsible for the Carter Coaster, which incorporates a complete breakthrough in electric motors. At his small Tamworth factory, Mr. Carter developed this combined engine and brake system which fits into the hub of each wheel. It works fine. It's claimed that these small motors give tremendous acceleration. Mr. Carter says that within five years, he expects to see about a quarter of a million on Britain's roads. So now the race is on to get rival electric cars onto the market. And over at the British Motor Corporation's Longbridge headquarters, they don't intend to be left behind. In conjunction with a battery firm, it's planned to build an electric town car within two years. That's what ace car designer Alec Isigonis is working hard at. This is just a rough idea of what BMC's electric auto may look like. But Britain is way ahead of the world with its plug-in car projects.